ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನೋ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಚಾಕಲ್ಪತರುವಶಿಪಿಂಧುಪ್ಯವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆ ವೈಷ್ಣವೀಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂ ಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಪಂಗೋಂಗ್ಲಂಘೈತಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂ ವಂದಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದು ಮಾಧವ ಬಿಂದಾವೈ ತುಸಿದೇ ವೈ ಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವಶ್ಚ ಕೃಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿಪದೇ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರುಂಚನುರುತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿಂ ಸ್ವರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರುಣ ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವವಿರಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ಭೀತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಬನುತಪಾಲಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರಣಿಂದ ಯಪ್ಪಲ್ಲವನ ಕಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋಧೂಷ್ವಾದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಗರ ಸಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮೈ ಕದಾಕೋಷಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭುನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವಸಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭುನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವಸಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನಕ ಬುಧಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕವಿತರು ಕಮಲಾಯತಾಕ್ಷ ಭೀಶಾಂಬರೌ ವಿಜವರು ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೇ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿ ದಿವ್ಯೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷಿ ತ್ವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣೋ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗು ಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವಾರಾಣಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜವೀಶನಾಥ ೀಶಜುಷು ಬದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ ಚ ಭಕ್ಷಿ ಜಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬಿಹಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಹೇ 
हृदय यस्व प्रेरणया पवर्तित अहम बरा करूप अपि तस्यो हरे हे पदकमलम वंदे चैतन्य देवस्य हृदय यस्व प्रेरणया पवर्तित अहम बरा करूप योपि तस्यो हरे हे पदकमलम वंदे चैतन्य देवस्य हृदय यस्व प्रेरणया पवर्तित अहम बरा करूप अपि तस्यो हरे हे पदकमलम वंदे चैतन्य देवस्य शिष्य भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर बहुपा परमंश जगत गुरु जी ने गोड़ी गोष्ठी गोड़ी भक्ति सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर बहुपा टोल्ड एट इन दिस वर्ल्ड we are not here to become a servant to make house of brick and stone we are not here to be a worker to become a worker of brick and stone we are not here in this world that to establish ourselves in this world we are not here in this world our our goal is only one that is to do bhajan of the lotus feet of guru vishnu and bhagwan that is the only udeshya of our life there is no any other motive in our life except to worship guru vishnu and bhagwan lotus feet sila bhakti siddhant saraswati goswami thakur prabhupa ji ne bataya sila bhakti saraswati thakur prabhupa told guru pad padma mein hamara paikantiki to develop ekantiki bhakti at the lotus feet of guru pad padma is very important for us kaisa how we can develop extreme attachment to the lotus feet of guru pad padma prabhupad speaking the actual disciple that an actual disciple always uh, thinking guru pad padma as krishna himself he is not at all indifferent he is indifferent from bhagwan this is very important to understand guru pad padma sat guru dev is not different from krishna who is krishna that is guru dev nishkapat shishyo to have nishkapat bhav to have to be nishkapat shishya bhagwan ka na bhakti karta hai yashu devi parati they do bhakti on to the lotus feet of guru dev This is the shlok of Shri Mad Bhagavat Gita Mahapuran. This is written in Bhagavatam. Jo shishyo aisa bhav leke Guru Ji ka seva nahi karta hai. That disciple who is not doing actual Guru seva like this, then he lost uh, he lost his uh, place as a shishya and get deviated from the track. डायरेक्ट इमेज ऑफ कृष्ण हिमसेल्फ एंड नॉट टू टेक दर्शन ऑफ गुरु पाद पद्म एस कृष्ण हिमसेल्फ देन यू कांट You can't speak Shuddha Hari Nam from your mouth. जब मैं शरल भाव लेके अंदर और बाहर में समान भाव लेके when externally and internally both I have a humble mood and I से गुरु पाद under the guidance of a Guru Pad Padma and always desire to do the Guru Gorang Seva. और ये समझ में आए and then I can understand that. that the updesh of bhagwan his vani swarup hamara guru pad padmo tak extended hai it is extended to our guru pad padmo bhagwan kab ka abhirbhav liya aur guru ji this is not that bhagwan has already descended 
and gurudev is uh, not there if we have a very humble attitude and we are doing guru gorang seva with humble mood and we are ready to hear that my guru pad padma is is in the line of shot pantha is in the line of guru parampara intact perfectly in the line of guru parampara and the vani and updesh of bhagwan and all the teachings of bhagwan is extended up to our guru pad padma this is not that if guru is speaking something then the teaching of krishna is something else to do worship of guru pad padma is a very big utility this is the utility of serving guru pad padma because according to the parampara perfection the nirdesh vani siddhan swarup of bhagwan can go intact under the guidance of gurudev we can get that this is called guru parampara ka utility this is called the utility of guru parampara I am here to follow the Nidesh and Nidesh of Guru Pad Padma. I just have to follow my Guru Pad Padma. That's it. We have already discussed in Gita Pravachan that to serve guru pad padma it is a duty of a disciple or more precisely and if more i like to say or clearly batae and more precisely if i want to say seva koi galti nahi hai lekin seva sachmuch seva honi chahiye actual seva should be there there should not be any uh, uh, aur ek shabd hai seva the actual duty of the disciple is to follow the instructions of gurudev this is more precise you can't go here and there by just telling the name of seva somebody can act but in toto in order to follow the exact instructions of guru pad padma that is actual guru seva like ramanuja charya ji shishya kuresh ji his disciple kuresh has done it everything kuresh has given to onto the lotus feet of gurudev by body speech and mind it is very easy to speak prabhu pa speaking charana means now 50 paisa is not there प्रोपा स्पीकिंग ने चुवन्नी का भाव ओनली फिफ्टी पैसा भाव इज देर ये चलेगी नहीं दिस विल नॉट वर्क इन द वे ऑफ शुद्ध भक्ति तो गुरु जी का सो आदेश निर्देश को टू फॉलो द इंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ गुरुदेव इन टैक्ट वे दिस इज एक्चुअल सेवा दिस कैन ऑल्सो बी पॉसिबल दैट गुरुदेव इज externally not given me the instruction that you should do like this but internally you are getting that instruction but it can be done so in order to bolte nahi sometimes gurudev didn't speak that you have to do this seva but we have to understand the internal bhavana bhav of our gurudev that is also the actual instruction that the disciple is following of his gurudev so in order that if he follows that it will be more precise and good for example if like mahaprabhu like mahaprabhu in purushottam dham hera panchmi ka at the day of hera panchmi samay jo raja pratap ruddh parisha pato sab koi ko aadesh de diya he was instructing the raja pratap ruddh in another that uh, prabhu how you will do gundita majran and everything इट इज रिटर्न इन जतन चरितामृत राजा प्रताप रुद्र 
servant all his adesh all the instructions he has given to the servant that whatever is required for mahaprabhu for the gundicha marjan seva you have to give to him and sometimes it can happen that sometimes mahaprabhu will not give any instruction but still you have to understand what else is required for mahaprabhu this is the instructions of raja pratap rudra this is a very big thing not a matter of joke so in order to follow guru pad padma means it it is followed when when our our heart is equal is harmonized with our guru pad padma heart then only we can understand what gurudev is speaking so in order to follow the instructions means that when gurudev is satisfied with us that is called topmost guru seva ab ye baat hai now prabhupad ji keh rahe hain in the whole in the whole world i am nobody in the whole world i don't want to hear any any advice from any pandit and advisor and i will not ignore my guru pad padma after hearing hearing the advice of others this is not my darshan that i will not do at all guru pad padma ka aadesh palan karne ke liye jo to follow the instruction of guru pad padma agar mere ko dam bhi khuna i have to, if i become if i have to go down to the level of uh, a beast also i'll come down in order to do guru seva karne ke liye taiyar hai ye kitna bada baat hai this is a very big point very main point a normal person can't understand this ek udharan de de i can give you one example samajhne mein suvidha hogi it will be easier and better for you to understand भक्ति आलोक परमंश महाराज यू मस्ट हैव हर्ड हिज वैष्णव नेम ही इज द इज अ गुरु वर्ग ओनली द डिसाइपल ऑफ भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती ठाकुर प्रभुपाद किसी को लड़ाई झगड़ा उसको ही डिडंट फाइट विद एनी वन सो सिंपल इन्होंने थोड़ा बहुत जगह व्यवस्था किया मायापुर में मंदिर करने के लिए परमंश महाराज जस्ट हैज मैनेज टू गेट वन लैंड देयर इन मायापुर एंड दैट लैंड वाज देयर फॉर सो मच टाइम अनयूज्ड there was nothing to do and because money was not there so no construction was done there and there at that time one wicked person one wicked person that person was working in a krishna nagar station his mother and father just came from bangladesh to that place to isi avastha mein in that that place at the bank of ganga they saw that the that the land is empty so that we can take it and we can make one bamboo structure there and can stay there and paramans maharaj just heard this news that that land is captured then he is so simple that he don't want to fight with anyone then he then paramans maharaj went to shila भक्ति विज्ञान भारती गोस्वामी महाराज द डिसाइपल ऑफ भक्ति दईत माधव महाराज और जाजावर महाराज को जाजावर जाजावर गोस्वामी महाराज आदि सभी ने एंड जाजवर याजवर गोस्वामी महाराज एट सेक्टर ऑल ब्रह्मचारी को हैव गिवन देयर एडवाइस दैट नरोत्तम ब्रह्मचारी वी शुड डू लाइक दिस सो दैट ही इज आवर गॉड ब्रदर दे हैव कैप्चर्ड देयर लैंड सो वी शुड डू समथिंग वी कांट डू एनीथिंग इन इन द मॉडर्न टाइम नोबडी विल डू एनीथिंग everyone is just looking for their belly to get filled up narottam thakur speaking yes yes definitely i will go and do i'll take some action jajavar goswami maharaj adi sab jajavar goswami maharaj by the taking the adesh of yadur goswami maharaj instruction bharti goswami maharaj going so tall figure long and tall going with a stick going with this sanyas stand there and there in front of the 
फादर एंड मदर ऑफ दैट पुलिस मैन ए जस्ट एम टी गेट गेट एम टी दैट प्लेस डू एम टी दिस प्लेस अदरवाइज एनी एक्शन कैन बी डन फ्रॉम माई पार्ट एंड विद वन हैंड ही इज हैविंग वन बिग स्टिक इन हिज हैंड ए यू हैव टू एम टी दिस प्लेस दिस इज द प्लेस ऑफ माई गुरु महाराज यू हैव टू एम टी दिस प्लेस इफ यू आर नॉट गेटिंग इफ यू नॉट एम टी दिस प्लेस देन आई एम गोइंग टू द पुलिस and whatever you want to do you can do them and the pers- and your boy who is working in police station his his job he will get disqualified from his job that much uh, that much thing and that much power i have in me they started crying and they said that oh lot of uh, money i have uh, invested on this uh, uh, land by making a bamboo structure then maharaj ji just speaking them to empty the place and uh, next day when maharaj ji came then they saw that the uh, place was empty so that is the actual adarsh of guru seva it is not a kind of uh, a seva of uh, dog and cats not to do the bhog of guru maharaj this is not guru seva गुरु महाराज माई गुरु महाराज ऑलवेज ऑलरेडी आई रिटर्न आर्टिकल मठवास गुरु मठवास हाउ टू टू भोग ऑफ गुरु देव गुरु जी का आज्ञा पालन करने के लिए मेरे को बाय फॉलोइंग इंस्ट्रक्शंस ऑफ गुरु देव इफ आई हैव टू कम एट द लेवल ऑफ अ बीस्ट आल्सो एंड इन इंफिनिटी टाइम आई हैव टू गो टू नरक टू हेल देन आई एम able to go there no worries for me main guru pad padma ka aagya chhod kar kisi ka baat i can't follow anyone except guru pad padma jagat basi ka jo chinta srot hai the whole the flow of their thinking of the whole world all material people itna negative thinking they have very negative flow of thinking jo guru pad padma ka that that by the power of guru pad padma their mind can be changed what they are following that uh, path that can be changed just by the mercy lotus lotus feet mercy of guru pad padma that is the power of of my guru pad padma parama shrishta If I can take one dust particle from the lotus feet of my Guru Pad Padma, and lakhs and crores of adni, I can spread it on their head. Then that one transcendental, one transcendental dust particle will allow all the mangal in his life. That is the power of my Guru Pad Padma lotus feet. There is no pandit in this world. who is having any sad vichar there is no one in this whole universe who can compare with the one dust particle of the lotus feet of my guru pad padma that is so much heavy there is no pandit in this whole 14 universe as well who can compare compare the one dust particle of my guru pad padma's lotus feet they are not heavier than that that the actual disciple actual disciple of a gurudev if not following this instructions of the guru pad padma na jatae apna zindagi mein to uska liye kuch then his life is nothing बहुत सारे उदाहरण दी गिवन लॉट ऑफ एग्जाम्पल्स पोपा जी ने बहुत सारे उदाहरण दी एक ट्रेन का यात्री का साथ उदाहरण दिए हैं गिवन एग्जा
One train is just running on the track and a person a traveler a traveling in the train is sitting there. While the train, while the train is running. And from inside the train, they are seeing all the villages, all the trees, and all the forest, all the grounds, all are running from inside the train. As if they are watching it all, they are watching that all is running and they are just uh, running in the backward direction. And I am sitting in one place and everything is running. And the traveler, he was while sitting. He is actually going from one place to another. The traveler, all are seeing that everything is going in the backward direction. It is not like this. But the traveler who is sitting in the train, they are actually they are actually themselves running from one place to another and all the grounds forest and all the rivers they are at the same place only they are not running this is the this is the thinking of a foolish person they can't understand this this whole whole earth all foolish persons in this whole earth because Hari Bhajan is not possible for every person. The person who is very super intelligent, only it's possible for that. Who has a Prakrit intelligence in him? No one can do Hari Bhajan apart from him. Whether he is having doing Hare Krishna or having a Tilak Mala, but still, he cannot do Hari Bhajan. Exact Hari Bhajan. A Prakrit intelligence, super intelligence is very important. Only they can do Hari Bhajan by having Tattva Gyan inside their mind. Otherwise, a normal person can't do that. This, on this earth, all the persons on this earth, they are all Hari Bhakti without Hari Bhakti. They always think that Guru Vaishnava, that Guru Vaishnava, whatever they are doing, Bhajan of Bhagwan, what they are doing, they are doing all wrong. All the persons, all the bonded souls, they are always thinking like this. That all these, uh, all these Vaishnavas, they are all doing wrong. They, they are not doing any uh, duties of uh, this world for their welfare, for the welfare of the mother and father. And they are, they didn't get married. What they are doing? They are all wrong. This is the, we have duty for our nation. We, we should uh, distribute medicine. We should do for the welfare of others. Everything. They are all going on the wrong way. Those who are ignorant. They, they, you know, the, all the bonded persons, they always used to figure uh, wrong things in the sadhu. Because they are in the... Because they think that they are in the form of an apparent Gyan. Because what they see practically, they believe that. But apart from that, there is another world, they can't understand that. This is there in the, in the Sadhu Samaj as well. For very slight La Puja Pratishtha, you just need to... You just... Just need to kick the actual actual path of Hari Bhajan whatever Prabhupada Ji Kesha Goswami Bhakti Thakur told they are not doing at all just reverse they are showing and I am not seeing any fault in all these bonded souls only the persons who with having Akshad Gyan Pratyaksha Gyan they have to follow the general lunar regulations of the Vedas and the 
and the Upanishads and the Purans. All the ethical character, everything which is there in the Shastras. There is a lot of people are there out of the of the rules and regulations of the Shastra. How to live in this world and what are the what are the duties towards the this world? They always think that the Guru Vishnu always going in the wrong direction. What they are doing? They are saying that you have to go get the money and then you take your food. Bhakti Vilati Thrasana Maharaj by smiling used to speak that you have to work hard then only you can take your food. Then that everyone used to take the food with the hard work only they used to take their food like horse like dumb cat dog everyone so this bonded uh, material person always used to swing yeah, all these sadhus they used to just uh, sit and just eat. They don't do anything. That Teeth Goswami Maharaj used to speak. That all those horses and dumb asses they used to take food by standing up. But the person always used to sit and they have to take their food. So the vichar of this material bonded soul everything house money position name fame and what is the duty towards their brother mother father and nothing has done for the welfare for the poor people so in bengali it is written they have taken an external base but uh, in externally they are doing nothing for this uh, material world for their welfare that's why they have become sadhu because they can't do anything just a two day boy he is and he has become a sadhu they are just serving Guru Vaishnav and just came to the, man, to the temple and he don't want to do any job or work and without that without working hard for anything he just came here to eat because Guru Vaishnava always are asakt by body, speech and mind they are serving Krishna day and night this is the actual desh of Bhagavata by everything by body speech mind everything you have to do the seva of Hari by learning all the Upanishads with Purana and everything he is very educated by knowing the technology it is that everything should be get uh, attached to Hari Nam whatever language whatever translation you are doing everything should be attached with Hari Bhajan with Hari Kirtan just try to translate and just write but at the bonded people always material people thinking they are just uh, uh, putting uh, uh, they are just uh, they just think that uh, uh, Guru Vaishnava nothing they are doing next to nothing Mater- material people always think that this Mr. Banerjee is uh, a person of uh, lot with lot of money and property and he is doing uh, a lot of we- for the welfare of the society there is a right for voting who has won the majority while voting he will win but for a Prakrit Jagat transcendental uh, jagat this is not the place of voting so that you can elect it by voting this is not a voting life 
that you can vote and you can elect an acharya in the transcendental world if, if there is a prabhupada at one place and the whole world whole universe at the other place then prabhupada will be more heavier like prabhupada used to speak in a running train the traveler from the window if he if he is watching the other train all the grounds and everything they are all running 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 but it's not that case this is a wrong conception bhagwan ka sevak kabhi ulta kam nahi kar sakta bhagwan sevak the supreme lord servant cannot do anything wrong externally externally he can do wrong but by the vichar dhara of bhagwan he cannot do anything wrong like hanum shri hanuman ji has burnt all the puri and all uh, the uh, all the lanka of ravan but there should be a punishment for uh, hanuman ji hanuman ji but hanuman ji has not done any injustice to anyone they have not done any crime rather than he has done seva for shri ram the bhakt of bhagwan the dis- devotee of bhagwan all proper adjustment arthat will will go with all proper adjustment he can utilize each and everything for guru vishnu bhagwan seva it is only possible for a bhagwan bhakt to hi tamam cheezon ko bhagwan se bhagwan ka seva mein utilize he can utilize it for guru vishnu bhagwan seva but a bonded material person ya to enjoyment he can only do material enjoyment or either he can go for a detachment but both of the uh, both of the uh, ways are not applicable to get actual bhajan isme to mangal ka rasta nahi khulega koi bhi vastu ka whatever all proper adjustment karne se bhagavat seva mein whatever thing you should have you should have all proper adjustment you should get jahan anu किशनो से भाई जहा होय अनुकूल विषय बोलिया तहा तेगे होय भूल किशनो से भाई जहा होय अनुकूल विषय बोलिया तहा तेगे होय भूल विषय बोल के देख करना इसको उचित है एक रनिंग ट्रेन का एक सवारी का जो विचार है ऐसा ही है समाज का आदमी सोचता है कि दुनिया का आदमी क्या गलती करे क्या हाथ पीछे कर रहा है थिंक दैट ओ यू आर ऑल ऑल डूइंग गुड यू आर ऑल डूइंग रॉन्ग दिस इज द कंसेप्शन ऑफ अ मटेरियल पीपल तमाम आदमी जो कर रहे हैं ऑलवेज थिंक दैट द गुरु वैष्णव गुरु वैष्णव आर डूइंग रॉन्ग एंड वी आर डूइंग द राइट थिंग दिस इज अ वेरी रॉन्ग कंसेप्शन वो बात ये होता था कि समझाना चाहते थे कि Prabhupada always used to speak this. That uh, the traveler, which is having a very wrong conception of uh, that uh, running train, that uh, 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 that this earth is in stand still uh, position and sun is rotating around that earth lekin ye dharna baad mein badal gaya but this conception just got reversed after that that earth is moving and sun around the sun suraj ek position mein is suraj sun is in static position and earth is moving around its orbit प्रभुपाद ने बहुत सारे विचार बताया प्रभुपाद है अमृतों का जो अमृत है लाइक द उपदेश अमृत अमृत प्राप्ति करने के लिए दिस अमृत इफ वी वॉन्ट टू टेक इफ वी वॉन्ट टू हमारा पूर्व पूर्व जो गुरु वर्ग जो है हमारा वी वॉन्ट टू टेक इन आर लाइफ एकदम देन अनुगत तो जरूरी है we should have a proper anugatya under the guidance of our previous guru vishnu ka jo vyakti guru vargo ka anugat 
if any if any person under the name of guru seva just want to make sure that uh, he can he can fill up his pocket with money position rank that is just dif- reverse they are not doing guru seva they are doing business with guru dev this is a wrong conception they haven't given they haven't done any guru seva they are just filling up their uh, uh, pockets wow, guru seva is actually done by baman goswami maharaj tirth goswami maharaj hamara avar keshav goswami maharaj ha bhakti maharaj ji sab bhakti goswami maharaj प्रभुपाद हैज रिटन अ लॉट ऑफ आर्टिकल्स ऑन गौड़िया मठ हु कैन लिव इन गौड़िया मठ वट शुड बी द एक्चुअल विचार ऑफ अ गौड़िया मठ डिवोटी लॉट ऑफ आर्टिकल्स प्रभुपाद हैज ऑलरेडी रिटन ऑन दिस जहाँ शुद्ध ज्ञान लाभ के लिए वे आर फॉर प्योर ज्ञान all the jeevas they are taking shelter of the guru pad and by body speech and mind they are going to serve guru pad pad and we are always radha govind aur hari is nitya seva is going on that is mat mat ko aisa nahi ke are mat is not a oh, let's let's go to mat where we can take food and we can sleep and we can do enjoyment this is not mat was this is not at all much pass isse to acha hai gau seva karna this is uh, it is better to do cow seva rather than to give uh, brahmachari bol ke sanyasi bol ke rakhe hue the persons who are uh, by name brahmachari and sanyasi it's better to do cow seva rather than to serve them who just want to eat and just want to sleep ye sahi vichar hai this is the actual vichar ye sahi vichar hai hum kal charcha karke dikhayenge this i can uh, demonstrate in the next katha kal hum charcha karenge is vishay par tomorrow we will discuss about it what is gaudiya mat pashando admi these are all pashandis they are all kapati they in the name of gaudiya mat who are looting who are looting everyone gaudiya mat keh rahe hain gaudiya mat is speaking they are all number 1 kapat indian panel code mein they should be they should be given they should they should swear in front of indian panel code that whatever do they are doing there it's right they are all kapat because they want to they, they want to enjoy guru vaishnav and mat gaudiya mat just for la puja pratishtha just for their own la puja pratishtha the punishment given in the indian panel code which is not written there that punishment should be given to them jagat ka aadmi ullu is mati do the person in the middle or the foolish they are going Sahana after them because they don't need any bhakti they want glam or position Sahana name Sahana fame one disciple of vaman goswami maharaj 8 months before he came here in the kaushala and uh, doing some seva here Uh, no he just came in the library unhone bola maharaj hum math mein pura kulam he said that maharaj in the math that uh, what kind of bhajan you are doing in the math only you are doing uh, 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 taking food without onion and garlic that's it we are not taking meat not taking onion and garlic that's it uh, i just uh, started laughing I already have spoken in the Mat Maharaj that we are just eating food without onion and garlic. Otherwise, nothing. So Upadesh Amrit. By speaking the word Upadesh Amrit is very important. That Shri Larup Goswami Pad. This uh, given by Shri Larup Goswami Pad Upadesh Amrit because Prabhupada Upadesh Amrit are there and other Upadesh Amrit are also there. because so shila rupa sarvadi is the eternal parshad of uh, uh, bhagwan by watching the actual rukta vairagya of rupa ko swami pad then tum log apna dainyo ko sangbaran karo mahaprabhu used to speak that oh rupa sanatan apna dainyo ko sangbaran karo try to 
you just check your uh, humble mood by swinging your humble mood my heart is just melting up i think it's sinking i know what is there inside your heart but you should check your humbleness but who has that humble attitude he will always having that he will always express that humble attitude in this modern world nowadays in this to modern version of samaj the condition of the godiyamat nowadays is very very worse because they don't want to take the instructions of prabhupad and bhakti mr thakur but they are always uh, taking up one or some points of prabhupad like keshav goswami also says devils can also go speak like hirane keshpo always used to take three four three four take uh, three four words from the shastra and raman also but it doesn't mean that they have become sadhu so the rules and uh, adarsh and etiquette of prabhupad and bhakti mr thakur nobody wants to take that they are just uh, they are just doing drama that prabhupad oh has spoken this and prabhupad has spoken that but they actually don't want to get that in application in their life so, who just wants to do drama he will do drama i have already seen that <coughs> millions of dollars one acharya is having kaam ka achar jo nahi hai naam ka acharya he is only the acharya by name not by his work no important for him when he came in the sabha the person who is very old and who has done a lot of seva in the math he said okay oh you 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 stay side you don't speak and i was laughing at that why he has become a charya because he is just going in the foreign country and just collecting money that is the conception of the modern samaj but keshav ko swami mara sant ko swami they are not like that all this so this is the condition and that person also he is so foolish that he also just he just sit there and uh, the senior devotee senior vaishna he was uh, not sitting on the uh, vyasasan like in the family life also some grandmother some grandfather came in our in our house then we have to give uh, then we have to give respect to them whether he is a dumb or a deaf or an ass but still we have to give him the respect in a similar way we also have that conception but shrimad bhagavat mahapuran has didn't teach us like this like sukhdev ko swami pad only 16 years old all father grandfather grand grandfathers they were all uh, paying uh, prostrate and obeisances on to his lotus feet quality adarshan adarsh acharan has no value in this modern world there are some values like the instructions of uh, prabhupada and uh, all guru vishnu they have a value but in front of those foolish bonded soul it is nothing agar guru padma mere ko sikhaya if guru padma has uh, has given me the instruction oh beta you have, or oh son you have to go like this you have to go like this in your bhajan ek agar adarsh dikha uske usko siddhanto bhi jab sikhaya then uh, that foolish disciple he just kicked that but they don't know that even their father also don't have that power that my guru dev has speak on this that's why they haven't uh, came in front of guru dev just uh, from far distance they are speaking but in front of guru vishnu they can't speak anything because they don't have any other sadarshan just for just for pratishtha he is just speaking foolish but this instructions of upadesha amrit it is a very big reason that whole world is going in the negative way negative way and how they can we can emphasize on increasing the bhajan aprakrit power in a person and i am 
एंड आई डोंट वॉन्ट टू लिसन टू एनी वन एंड एडवाइस आई एम ऑलवेज देयर आई एम ऑलवेज देयर टू टेक द शेल्टर ऑफ द लोटस फीट ऑफ दैट सदगुरु हु कैन गिव हंड्रेड परसेंट This is the slope. If I seek the path leading to the absolute good, then I must ignore the countless voices of popular wisdom and listen only to that of the realized soul. मैं ने जगत का आदमी का कोई है ना उपदेश ने के लिए अरे हमारा गुरुजी ये उपदेश दिया. I am not here to listen to the material bonded person. They will definitely go into hell, but they are also taking others in the hell for infinity period as well. This is the condition now. Nothing can be done now. This is the condition of the of this world now. Everyone wants to fill his pocket, want to fill his belly. We can't do anything. We have to follow the pattern what Propa told, like of Shiva Goswami Maharaj, Keshav Goswami Maharaj, all of Guru Guru what they have taught us. To Upadesh Amrit, how we have to discuss about Upadesh Amrit? Yes, sir. Chacha, start. We will start the instructions of Upadesh Amrit. Prabhupada speaking that in the modern world, all these material bonded persons. They. these material bonded people taking the whole of desh amrit and just dump it into a godown they have a godown where they want to dump all the darshanik darshan philosophy and everything they just want to do lock and key and they have made their new philosophy and just giving a wrong direction to the whole world so this unique gem of prabhupad is just jo sad gaya hai wo aalu there in lokan ki in the nahi pekne ka kabhi go down like the case of a potato if one potato lot of potatoes are there in the go down it will just get destroyed if if you will not use it so the vichar dhara of prabhupad keshav ko sunar maharaj and our guru work they have just Uh, thrown it into the go down, dumped it into the ground. I have lot of books have been uh, published of Prabhupad, Upadesh Amrit, Bhakti Vinod, Vani Vaibhav. They don't want to get published. Why they don't want to get published? Because you can go forty to fifty years back. Uh, they have published it in the magazine. Why they have stopped it? Because it is. what the what kind of preaching i want to do i can't do that it is not preaching it is cheating so you can print you can you can publish ujwal neel mani and everything but prabhupad upadesh amrit bhakti vinod vani vaiva etc you should not publish this is their foolish thinking because their cheating cannot go up to some extent this is not preaching so prabhupada speaking what is the kram what is the step by step process of bhajan so all those sahajiya they are going a uh, opposite direction prabhupada speaking that anarth yukta without anarth when there is no anarth no anarth in when there are lot of anarth in our heart in this condition bhajana kriya is possible jo bhajan ek tatpar jo main nahi hai bhajan kriya is not possible in anarth yuk stage if you you have to concentrate on this otherwise you will become like an owl समाचार इज स्पीकिंग ओ यू शुड डू भजन नो वरीज इन अनर्थ युक्त वस्तु ऑल्सो यू कैन डू रागनु का भजन फुलिश नंबर वन सो दिस प्रभुपा स्पीकिंग द मुक्त पुरुष भजन एंड द पर्सन हु इज इन अनर्थ स्टेज देयर भजन क्रिया इज नॉट 
on the same level it's very different to do bhajan in the anarth anarth free stage like a mirror lot of dust is there so much dust is there like a curtain it is so you just need to remove that dust and to remove that dust you it is like uh, doing bhajan with an earth jaise you are given a responsibility to clean a you know a mirror having a covering of dust this is in the stage of anarth yukta avastha when there is anarth kisi ko humne bataya beta thoda isko safai kar de to ye jo darpan ke upar so you need to you need to remove the dust from the mirror so in the anarth yukta avastha when there are lot of anarth in our heart the bhajan paddhati the bhajan kriya of the bhajan kriya can be compared with this point what example i have quoted now just try to rub that dust off from the mirror but in the case of a uh realize soul like a belgium glass where is not even a single dust particle on it where they are just uh, uh, taking darshan of their own face beautiful face this is the actual version of a uh, realize soul so this is the difference between uh, anarth yukta avastha and uh, a siddha avastha that is the darshan drishti in the anarth yukta avastha only our bhajan is like uh, is like like our uh, subtle body and our fine body our fine body means like mind body intellect false ego and uh, subtle body is uh, like uh, f- made of five elements water air fire earth ether so there are lot of anarth in this anarth yukta bhakta and our bhajan so it this example we already have baba ji maharaj had discussed like to remove the dust from the mirror this is the bhajan in anarth yukta avastha and in anarth yukta avastha the bhajan kriya of uh, the bonded soul it is attached with the fine and subtle body because the fine body and the subtle body our relationship is not yet destroyed completely it is more or less there with us but it is not destroyed completely the person who has done uh, what degree of bhajan sincerely his power according to the proportion that he can advance in his bhajan and can cut his anarth in the anarth yukta avastha it is attached with the subtle and fine body so there is a lot of difference what we have already told baba ji mara speaking again and again this thing there is a hell and hell difference there is not a hell and difference hell and hell and uh, heaven difference but lot of difference which cannot be compared when our subtle and fine body under the guidance of our gauriya guru guru varga 
वी आर डूइंग भजन देन वी कैन अंडरस्टैंड दैट वॉट इज अनर्थयुक्त वक्ता वॉट इज द एक्चुअल स्वरूप दिस विल कम डेफिनेटली सो वी कॉन्ट स्पीक एवरी टाइम दैट इन अनर्थवस्था यू कैन हेयर रास लीला एंड यू कैन रीड उलू नील मोली दग्ध माधव नील माधव वेयर इट इज रिटर्न यू कैन शो मी इट इज रिटर्न नो वेयर इट्स जस्ट अ फुलिश कॉन्सेप्शन मेड बाई हिज ओन माइंड भक्ति विनोद ठाकुर इन भजन रहस्य ऑलरेडी रिटर्न अ लॉट ऑफ इंस्ट्रक्शन बट दे हैव एन टेकन दिस विचारधारा भक्ति विनोद ठाकुर because they know that their so called preaching will not get preached only by uh, uh, getting the stage of the anarth nivrati actual hari naam can be done and after anarth nivrati actual hari naam actual hari naam can be possible otherwise not If Hari Nam is the actual, if Hari Nam is the actual, actual thing, then what? <laughs> Ras Lila is a material person is uh, always thinking like a Saturday Sunday club where ball dance uh, woman is doing. So they are comparing the Ras Lila of Krishna with that. They are always thinking like that. This is their Raganuga. Prabhupada always used to speak that there are four types of anartha. Sattatte, paratatte, sadhu santatte, virodhi tatte. These all are the swarup brahm, asatreshna, aparad, hirde door balle. Swarup brahm, sadhu. All these are the types of uh, anartha. अपराध On to lotus feet of Nam Prabhu, the devotees of Krishna, Dham Prabhu, and Nam Prabhu. All these are kind of different kind of abrads. Hidde to bolle. These are the four kind of. We will discuss it tomorrow. Now. By taking the instructions and shiksha of Korang Mahaprabhu, Shila Sanatan Goswami Pada, Shila Rup Goswami Pada, they have given the instruction to Rup Goswami and Sanatan Goswami Pada. Korang Mahaprabhu has given that. देर इज नथिंग मोर लेफ्ट टू बी स्पीक सनातन गोस्वामी के डायरेक्ट इंस्ट्रक्शन टू रूप गोस्वामी पद एंड सनातन गोस्वामी यू आर अ ग्रीडी आचार्य वाई बिकॉज यू हैव गिवन योर ओन इंस्ट्रक्शन नॉट द एक्चुअल इंस्ट्रक्शन गिवन बाई गौरंग महाप्रभु टू रूप गोस्वामी एंड सनातन गोस्वामी पद दैट्स द रीजन वाई रूप गोस्वामी पद इंस्ट्रक्शन कैन नॉट बी फॉल्स so to establish the instructions of uh, chaitanya mahaprabhu our guru work har vakat are always even fraction of second every second they have their uh, vichar dhara in their mind that how to do bhajan how to how to get that supreme absolute truth चैतन्य मन भीष्टम स्थापित जेन भूतले 
स्वयं रूप कदा मह्यम तदाती स्वपरांतिक Whatever the grants written by Rupa Goswami Prasad Nathan Goswami under the guidance of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, by his will, by the will of Mahaprabhu, Rupa Goswami Pad, Shila Rupa Goswami Pad, at the Dashamit Dashamit Ghat at Allahabad, uh, Mahaprabhu has given the instruction to Shila Rupa Goswami Pad and to Sanatan Goswami Pad. At the at Varanasi, for one month has given the instructions about how to do bhajan. Now the actual which are comes, what Sanatana Rupa Swamipad has not written. All the shastra they have just uh, uh, done the manthan of all the stars. And given us the final conclusion of all the shastras, they have uh, done this for us. But still, we are thinking that we are uh, so much audacity in ourselves that uh, we can understand that whatever the whatever the instructions given by Rupa Swami Pad Upadesh Amrit is the topmost. What kind of nectar we can get from Bhakti Rasamrit Sindhu? This is a nectar of ocean of Bhakti. You already know that. But like like Bhagavad, Bhagavad Amrit, Bhagavad itself is a portion of Amrit. Bhagavad has lot of transcendental nectar, but we can get that unique transcendental. Uh, uh, instructions in the form of Prahad Bhagavat Amrit written by Sanatana Goswami. Whatever we can't get uh, by reading Bhagavatam, just by just by reading Prahad Bhagavat Amrit, you can understand that. So, this Shopadesh Amrit written by Shri Laru Goswami Pad, it is not. Uh, less than Bhakti Rasamrit Sindhu. Still, Bhakti Rasamrit Sindhu is a, a, a big granth, a big shastra. But this shastra of Shri Ubudesh Amrit written by Shri Rupa Goswami Path, there is another uh, granth which is a jewel in the body of Bhajan. So, our Guru was already told that this Ubudesh Amrit is just a summary of Bhakti Rasamrit Sindhu. Just Upadesh Amrit is a summary uh, given by Srila Rupa Goswami Pad in 11 shlokas. It is a summary of Shri Bhakti Rasamrit Sindhu and has given us the instructions given by Gorang Mahaprabhu. What Mahaprabhu uh, has uh, uh, followed in his own life and has given the instructions uh, to the other devotees. Whatever Mahaprabhu has advised and what Mahaprabhu has uh, done himself, this is called Bhakti Rasamrit Sindhu. But if you want more uh, refined form of Siddhanta, then you have to go to Shri Upadesh Amrit. This is actually done by Shri Rupa Goswami. Because Rup, uh, Shri Upadesh Amrit is just getting completed into 11 shlokas. It is confined in 11 shlokas, but if you uh, go on uh, in-depth analysis of it, uh, it uh, Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu will uh, definitely get out of this 11 shlokas of uh, Shri Upadesh Amrita. So this is the actual gist, uh, the summary of Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu. Shri Upadesh Amrit written by Shri Laroop Goswami Pad. So this Upadesh Amrit uh, about Upadesh Amrit we are discussing about 
under the guidance of Guru Varg, Shridhar Goswami Maharaj, Keshav Goswami Maharaj, all our Guru Varg have taught us that, that these eleven shlokas of Upadesha Amrit, uh, in these eleven shlokas, there is all the mystery of the uh, bhajan. All the mystery of the Gauri Bhajan is there inside these 11 shlokas which is written by Shilda Rupa Goswami Bhad. This is hid, it is in the hidden form. This, the, the, the commentary written by Srila Bhakti Mura Thakur Ji, Srila Bhakti Siddhan Saraswati Goswami Thakur Prabhupada has written a commentary on it and other Guru works have also written a commentary on Srila Upadesha Amrit that if nobody can understand Upadesha Amrit, be very careful regarding this. If, if in somebody's life, the Upadesha of the Upadesha Amrit, the instructions given in Upadesha Amrit, if the instructions of the Udesh Amrit are uh, out of his mind, then Gauri Bhajan is not possible for him. It is not possible to him to do Gauri Bhajan at all. How he can do Gauri Bhajan? It is not possible. So in this way, our Guru Bhagai already taught us that Srila Rupa Goswami Bhad at the Prayag, at Prayag in Dasamed Bhat by the lotus mouth of Srila uh, Gaurang Mahaprabhu has bestowed the Uttama Bhakti which is called the Vastav Bhakti and has given the instructions about the Uttama Bhakti by Sri Gaurang Mahaprabhu who is Bhavan Bhavan himself this all it is there in a, a summer in a very detailed form in Bhakti Rasamrit Sindhu and in Avdesh Amrit it is it is there in the 11th shloka of Avdesh Amrit uh, the summary of that shloka what is written in Bhakti Rasamrit Sindhu And Rupa Goswami Padji also told in Bhakti Rasamrit Sindhu before, uh, before telling about Bhakti Rasamrit Sindhu, Srila Rupa Goswami Pad, before writing Bhakti Rasamrit Sindhu, he has bestowed a lot of humbleness by his humble mood. He has written. I am useless. I am poor. I have nothing in this world. I am just a beggar. I am just, uh, just uh, glorifying the lotus feet of that Gaurang Chandra Charan that by whom by whom uh, I am getting the zeal I am I am so much fallen so much fallen but still by the Kripa of Gaur Sundar I am doing this seva and I am the ready to do this seva that Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's lotus feet I always uh, worship this is uh, actually uh, spoken by Shila Rupa Goswami Pad. this is the actual foundation of Hari Bhajan that's why I have talked it before if there is no Danya Bhav inside then there is nothing if you learn lot of Shastra then also you cannot understand the realization you cannot get the realization whether you read with Abhimata, Lalit, Madhav, etc. Ujjwal, Nilmani, etc. If you read and you just uh, mention that you have Guru Bhakti inside your heart, it's not possible. Srila Vaman Goswami Maharaj used to speak that our Rupanu Guru Varga 
स्पेक्टेकुलर ही वो स्पीकिंग मैं शर्मिंदा हूँ I am very much afraid I am very much I am very much afraid that what kind of condition is going on now in the material world Bhavan Goswami used to speak Bhavan Goswami used to speak Hamara rupa 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 गुरु वर्ग दैट इज दैट इज माई रूपानु भजन वोट अ ब्यूटिफुल आंसर गिवन मशी लाम गोस्वामी महाराज सो डीप शिक्षा वामन गोस्वामी महाराज इज गिवन दैट वी हैव टू फॉलो द इंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ आर गुरु वर्ग दैट इज आर एक्चुअल भजन आई डोंट नो रूपानु भजन दिस इज जस्ट दिस इज जस्ट द शिक्षा गिवन बाय वामन गोस्वामी महाराज टू अस टू ऑल दस बॉन्डेड सॉल वी हैव सो मच फॉल्स यू गो इन साइड अवर हार्ट that uh, we can uh, we can put the whole world into the wrong track jo bhi hai shila krishna das ko viraj goswami shila krishna das ko viraj goswami chitne jadamrit has already spoken has spoken a lot of vichar uh, dhara like uh, how mahaprabhu used to teach the instructions to shila krishna das goswami and in gaudiya samaj as well and all the sadhus in the gaudiya samaj apne ko rupanugopur hi they are they they actually want to get established in rupanug bhajan like sanatan goswami also we are not talking about anyone else we are talking about sanatan goswami who is uh, such a big question of he is speaking uh, uh, himself as rupanu sakshat sanatan goswami shila sanatan goswami is also speaking himself as rupanu ji main rupanu ko that i am rupanu ga aur kya kehna hai what to speak of other things jeev goswami pad is tatvacharya baldev vidyabhushan everyone who bhakti vinod thakur and bhakti sidan saraswati goswami thakur prabhupad keshav goswami mar all hamara gudiyo ka ye sabse bada ye we have in our godia there is a very a big vichar dhara of this that mahaprabhu ka anugrah tab that under the guidance of our rupanug like under the guidance of mahaprabhu i want to give my identity as a rupanug vichar dena rupanugo bolke ye jo atma parichay i just want to give my atma parichay as a rupanug This is the most uh, highest designation ever in the history. Our Gopan, our Gopanu is uh, feeling uh, uh, Anand, Nityanand all the time. And Narottam Thakur also speaking this same. Uh, Narottam Thakur also speaking the same thing in in his kirtan. Suniya ji sadhu mukhe bole sarvajan sirup ki paaye mile jugal charan ittade bahut sare atha rupa ko rupa rup 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 anugatha under the guidance of Rupa Goswami Pad. Har koi everyone has to take the shelter of Rupa Goswami Pad in order to do rupa anug bhajan like Kaviraj Goswami कृष्णदास कवि रामजी चतने जाम ने दिया राइटिंग अबाउट द ग्लोरिफिकेशन ऑफ द लोटस फीट ऑफ रूप गोस्वामी बाज एंड प्रेइंग इन अंडर द लोटस फीट ऑफ रूप गोस्वामी पाद जगत गुरु शिला भक्ति सदन सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभु पाद ऑलवेज बिजी इन प्रीचिंग द हरि कीर्तन हरि कीर्तन हरि कथा ऑफ रूप अनुग भजन always used to preach prabhupad always used to preach this shloka sri radha bhav vibhavito sri chaitanya mahaprabhu manas samaj me krishna sri chaitanya mahaprabhu under the guidance of sri radha gobind with radha bhav and the aprakrit prem madhuri of sri sri radha gobind what is that that mahaprabhu has actually preached in order to Uh, in order to teach uh, the whole world about the uh, uh, prem vilas of radha govind mahaprabhu has descended on this earth lila ka anudhan 
दलीला दलीला ऑफ श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य महाप्रभु इज वेरी इम्पोर्टेंट टू रिमेम्बर द श्री चैतन्य लीला विद एन एक निष्ठ भाव इज वेरी मच इम्पोर्टेंट दैट इज दैट इज अवर फाइनल गोल We have to remember the instructions of Sri Chaitanya Lila under the guidance of our Guru Varg. That is our final goal. And the in the writings of uh, writings of uh, Sri Larup Goswami Path, we need to understand all this. We don't even a single Guru Varg like Rup Goswami, Sanatan Goswami, Balde Vidya Bhushan, Jeev Goswami Path. Everyone. भक्ति विनोद ठाकुर भी है प्रभुपाद दे हैवन ब्रोकन द बैरियर ऑफ दैट रूपानुग रूपानुग पाथवे वॉट हैज गिवन बाय रूप गोस्वामी पाद एंड दे हैवन डेवलप्ड एनी न्यू पाथवे ऑफ भक्ति दे हैवन डन दैट बिफोर सिंधु को उपदेश के द्वारा भक्ति सिंधु हाउ टू गेट कृष्ण भक्ति कृष्ण भक्ति कैसे प्राप्त किया जाए एवं श्री चैतन्य महापुरु शिक्षा एंड बाई श्री चैतन्य शिक्षा व्हाट इज द मिस्ट्री ऑफ कृष्ण भजन ही इज एबल टू गिव द इंस्ट्रक्शन अबाउट दैट एंड हाउ टू गेट कंट्रोल ओवर योर माइंड एंड हार्ट but nobody wants to pay any attention if your heart and your mind is going your sense organs are going other way and they are doing rupa anubhav this is just a kind of a big laughing for us in bhagavad gita mahapurana also it is written whatever bhajan how much bhajan you are doing whether if you are not doing gaudiya bhajan gaudiya bhajan is top most but in bhagavad gita mahapurana it's written that whatever bhajan you are doing फर्स्ट योर सेंस ऑर्गन शुड बी कंट्रोल्ड वेदर वॉट एवर यू डू कर्म ज्ञान योग एनी एनी योग दिस इज अथवे ऑफ भक्ति ओनली भक्ति इज अ टॉप मोस्ट पाथवे बट स्टिल इन ऑर्डर टू गेट इन कनेक्शन विद कृष्णा विद भगवान ओनली इट इज पॉसिबल बाय भक्ति उन बाय ध्यान वैराग्य ज्ञान एंड नथिंग कैन बी डन सो वेर एवर यू गो द टॉप मोस्ट विचार इज दैट यू हैव टू गेट कंट्रोल ओवर योर हार्ट योर चित इफ यू आर गेटिंग कंट्रोल ओवर योर चित योर माइंड योर हार्ट मटीरियल माइंड एंड बॉडी देन दिस इज अ टॉप मोस्ट विचार If your mind, uh, mind, heart is not under your control. Then it where where it is going like a crazy. In the morning also I was also telling that. It's going like mad. Our our my material mind. it is very important to control our material mind because it's very difficult to control that man ko pagla ghode ka saath tulna kiya gaya mind is actually compared with a crazy horse mad horse bada kripa ko upar bharosa it is uh, just uh, we have to depend on the kripa we don't uh, need to believe on anything else rather than on kripa भक्ति विनोद ठाकुर ऑलरेडी स्पीकिंग दिस इन उपदेश अमृत इन इज कमेंट्री कीर्तन लिखे सो नॉट कमेंट्री इन कीर्तन इट इज रिटर्न यू आर द ओनली शेल्टर ऑफ मी नो बडी इज देयर अपार्ट फ्रॉम यू तुम छोड़ के कुछ नहीं है सब गया एवरीथिंग हैज गॉन ओनली यू आर माय फेथ you are everything for me kisi rasta mein jao man ko every way you can go the most important thing is to get control over a material mind that is the most important factor and in the gita shlok also it is written 
all those material wishes, all those material objects, all the material bonded souls are going for material profit and loss. They are very much, uh, um, they are very much clever in that. Very much smart. They are thinking themselves as smart. They always have a vichar dhara about material profit and loss all the time in their mind. That's why in Gita Bhagavat is speaking. In which material world they are having a profit and loss account and they are feeling very happy by taking that uh, profit and loss account that uh, in that uh, condition uh, the topmost sadhu they don't want to show any consciousness about that they always are very unhappy about that and the and in which uh, vishay the material man is uh, uh, feeling uh, distress uh, sadhu is feeling very happy he is always uh, um, uh, careful about in that always careful that the sadhu is always careful in that case this is the topmost vichar which we have to remember our Guru Bhagavan already told us like Keshav Goswami Maharaj and all that to get Pramarthic Transcendental Vision for your spiritual life the first step you will have to take that is called that is called Guru Vanugatta or Guru Vanugatta and in Guru Vanugatta we have to uh, we have to give our mind, body, soul and everything onto the lotus feet why Guru Vanugatta? because uh, by our own effort because by our own effort it is not possible to get success in our life nothing can be done that's why guru kripa hi kevalam so, so spiritual life in order to build a spiritual life to get the your spiritual life on a top level you have to uh, get uh, control over your uh, uh, sense organs your material mind and heart the sadhak uh, the these material mind and heart and the sense organs are not controlled then uh, the sadhak can uh, uh, get thrown out of bhajan there is no guarantee about this all brahma shankar everyone no one no one has this uh, uh, power that they have shown oh yes we can uh, we, we can have victory over maya no they don't have this audacity in their in their in their heart they don't have this uh, courage but they can see that in, a, in the way of our spiritual bhajan we have to get control over our sense organs by the kripa of our guru not even brahma shiva nobody has uh, uh, encouraged to uh, speak like this why? Because, because Bhagavan Maya is Mamaya Duratya. They can't challenge that because it's the Maya of Bhagavan. They don't have this much courage. Nobody has this much courage to speak like this. So it is very far sighted thing. Even Shankar Bhagavan, when he saw so the Mohini Swarup of uh, Bhagwan uh, Krishna that uh, after watching uh, Mohini Swarup he just got uh, attracted to that and uh, Shiva uh, even Lord Shiva not even wondering that uh, uh, Uma Devi is uh, beside her and by watching Mohini Devi uh, Mohini Swarup of uh, Shri Krishna he just got attracted and uh, just uh, uh, running running uh, towards Mohini so we uh, even Brahma and Shankar don't have the power and they didn't encourage to speak that we can win over Maya 
first our material mind heart and sense organ should be get, should get controlled then only bhajan can get uh, start otherwise it is not possible to start our bhajan that is why it is written in upadesha amrit it is a very good introduction of the jitendra vyakti jitendra person that who has win over the sense organs material mind and heart in nowadays everyone is having a goswami title in front of his in front of his name nowadays the sanyasi uh, what the bhakti mohan thakur has written in his articles sadhu sangha pranali vichar all these articles written by bhakti mohan thakur we will be publishing shortly we are editing it in english you can see that bhakti mohan thakur all the time andar mein ek chinta have a, a very uh, distress a prakrit distress in his mind a tension is in mind bhakti mohan thakur already know before that after 150 years the condition of the bhajan life will become more worse where uh, each and every person will go after la puja pratishtha pratishtha ka piche dodega they will just go after pratishtha only that's it they don't want to do actual hari bhajan aur bahut mushkil hai this is very very difficult bhagwan sri krishna mahapuran mein bhagwan sri krishna in bhagwan ji mahapuran in 11th canto he used to uh, have already spoke to uddhav oh, uddhav this uh, karodi pakshi is a very small uh, uh, this small very small bird he got one uh, uh, piece of flesh and uh, he wanted to just uh, get it wanted to get that rasa of that flesh piece but when uh, all, all the other birds were uh, seeing that uh, flesh uh, in his mouth uh, then uh, all those birds uh, are getting uh, in front of that uh, small bird then he was uh, very much afraid why they are uh, coming in uh, uh, coming back of me then that small bird was uh, thinking that what uh, wrong i have done why all these birds are coming in uh, coming back of me then uh, when the uh, when the that flesh just got out from his mouth and all the birds are going towards that flesh and uh, then small bird was thinking oh ho oh, oh. ho just because of this uh, flesh uh, i was uh, i was just attacked by those birds then he understand that uh, just by getting uh, release from that flesh uh, i am also getting released so this example of a small bird is given by shri krishna to uddhav in bhagwan shri krishna telling to uddhav that if someone is going for pratishtha that uh, don't you don't need to speak anything to him and if you are going to uh, run for pratishtha then the others will come as an enemy uh, behind you there uh, in uh, hari katha when i was speaking in punjab and uh, all other an ordinary sadhu he always uh, thinking of himself as an acharya but he is nothing by the guidance of uh, under the guidance of guru varga i know what's his position he always wanted to speak that he is goswami but he is nothing this is a this is a technique of them that they wanted to tell themselves as uh, goswami whether he is whether their original name is lakkardas baba but uh, he just wanted goswami title in front of his name i have done a protest on this a lot why they are using the goswami uh, word in front of their uh, because uh, he don't have any uh, don't have any characteristic of a sadhu they don't even believe about uh, the sadhu what a sadhu is but still they are uh, uh, telling him that he is goswami i am just uh, speaking about that uh, why you are speaking yourself as goswami but still it's going on because if he is speaking goswami to other then that person will also speak him goswami so this pratishtha is going on and i have uh, given a strong uh, resolution regarding this against this and 
I have already uh, spoken in the Hari Katha as well uh, that he wants to speak him Goswami and the other person also gives him to Goswami just to get mutual understanding. But our Guru Bhag have already uh, spoken that uh, by having lot of money and he is going to foreign country whatever he is doing. Because you are not going to see that what his acharan is for his whole day. Uh, yeah, what he is doing in the foreign country. But you can't speak like uh, you, that he is Goswami. Because you don't have uh, uh, this offer that you can speak. Uh, you can tell him Goswami. Because he has lot of money. And uh, he is going to foreign country. He is not a Goswami. This is the actual... Uh, uh, Vichar Dhara of our uh, uh, today's modern world. So, this uh, before starting Upadesh Amrit, Rupa Goswami Pad, first Upadesh. Today's uh, world, uh, modern world, having a preaching standard is very bad. Why? Because they actually they have uh, uh, understand and they are actually doing a uh, other shacharan of the first Upadesh of Upadesh Amrit. No, they are actually not following. They can come in front of me and uh, speak the says we are following this first uh, Upadesh of uh, Srila Rupa Swami. Nobody is ready. Whatever is going on, Maharaj, what, uh, whatever is going, let, let it be done. No worries. If they want to die, they want to die. No worries. Who can go there? They are so lazy about this. But it is the Vichardhara of our Shastra. It is already written in the Shastra. You have, you have, you have, you have written. You have all heard about this or not? How you can heard? It is already written in Shri Chaitanya Charitamrit. Don't speak about Siddhant. Oh, it's very. Don't become lazy. Oh, it's very, very difficult. Like in Hari Katha, we can just speak about some story. Every and everything can be done. And from here and there, we can uh, just uh, give some story. And uh, okay, it is a very good compiled Harikatha. They have the base. They have this basic of Harikatha. That, uh, that, that he's speaking. He's speaking. That who's speaking? They always used to speak. He's speaking. He's speaking. He's speaking. He's speaking. The who is speaking? We just tell the name. Who is speaking? You are just uh, speaking, speaking, speaking and you are just uh, giving him uh, a kick. Who is speaking? All everything, all the sanskar, the, uh, this Varna Shankar because of this. Uh, in, our, in our Gaudiya Guru Parampara. So this is the way now this modern world is following. So this Goswami title, who can be Goswami? Actually, in this whole world, in this whole universe, he can be called as Goswami. And who can rule, rule, rule over? That is Parikshit Maharaj. That is Ambarish Maharaj. That is Yudhishthir Maharaj. They can do it. Why? How they are getting this much power? They are the ruler of the seven islands. And it's also written about the Prithu Maharaj as well. That they are the ruler of seven islands. How much power they have that we have just four members in our house and still the father can't control them. But they are just controlling the whole seven islands of this uh, whole world. How they are doing it? Why? Because he is Vaishnav. Parikshit Maharaj is Vaishnav. They have that uh, transcendental power in them. Why Amrish Maharaj getting so much power? That uh, a Rishi like Durvasa, he just, just gone mad. It is just only one uh, one reason because bhakti is a shakti. But they have bhakti inside their heart by taking fish, meat, everything. And uh, just by doing uh, uh, kaam bhog, this is not actual power. This is not a matter of playing. This is the actual power of bhakti. The power of bhakti is so much 
दैट एवरी थिंग कैन बी डन यू कांट इवन इमेजिन वॉट कैन बी डन दैन सप्त द्विपाधिपति ही इज अवन रूलर ऑफ सेवन सेवन आईलैंड सो वी हैव टू फॉलो द इंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ दिस पृथु महाराज एंड अम्बरीश महाराज बट इन आवर हाउस नो नो मदर एंड नो इवन ब्रदर फादर नो बडी वॉन्ट टू फॉलो अस बाय बिकॉज वी डोंट हैव भक्ति इन साइड आवर हार्ट इफ वी हैव भक्ति इन साइड हार्ट देन शक्ति कैन कम दैट इज द पावर कैन कम वॉट इज भक्ति दैट इज दैट इज द फॉर्म ऑफ स्वरूप शक्ति द स्वरूप शक्ति हु हैज गॉट कृपा ऑफ स्वरूप शक्ति ऑन इट only they can get the actual power there are nitya bhakta nitya mukta nitya nitya bad means who are bonded from infinity period because they do, don't have any kripa swarup shakti and uh, nitya mukta have uh, always a kripa of swarup shakti on them so that's why they are enjoying the full kripa of swarup shakti so that's why they have bhakti inside their heart anitya bhakta nitya mukta jeev nitya kishra seva ne unmukh kishra seva unmukh so they that's why they are able to do krishna seva because they are enjoying full kripa of swarup shakti and the bad the jeev uh, in the in the in his bonded state uh, when they got uh, the kripa of swarup shakti then uh, they will become uh, siddh in their later life and then they can uh, uh, attain that uh, nitya mukta sthiti so the bad the jeev want to uh, want himself uh, to be called as goswami just on the uh, basis of his money power man power and educational power kashi ka ek raja hai like uh, one king of kashi he wants to speak that he is vasudev in the in dwarka he just want to he want to speak to krishna that hey i am vasudev who are you if you are vasudev then you can come in front of me and give me the uh, give me the proof that you are vasudev then otherwise i will come to dwarka and destroy everyone then krishna just laughing and speaking are how he is speaking he have the at have this audacity that he is speaking that he is vasudev like in the at the time of bhakti vinod thakur one yogi was speaking that, that i am bhagwan that i am krishna i will do ras with the all the young ladies and he's taking all the young ladies into the forest and he's so clever and so clever that bhakti vinod thakur came there and uh, give him the moral that uh, <coughs> whatever doing you are wrong and uh, he was also speaking to bhakti vinod that i will uh, spoil your family and whatever you can do i will just kill you so his name was bij kishan uh, so bhakti vinod thakur just send him to the jail and uh, all uh, uh, the children and the wife of bhakti vinod thakur just got ill but bhakti vinod thakur saying that i will by the power of this uh, yogbal they want to give a mangal to us but no worries uh, my actual uh, protection is sudarshan but uh, today's life nobody wants to get uh, head in bhakti vinod by <laughs> by mutual uh, uh, attachment uh, they just want to go ahead like a mutual fund let us uh, do it by mutual understanding because the whole world is uh, like an owl they don't know anything so this is the situation going on now bhakti mun thakur uh, by giving this punishment to bijkishan that this yogi is uh, very clever he just wants to act smart so he has uh, bhakti mata ko have given him the uh, actual punishment what he wants so everyone uh, in this whole world like in the way of an acharya they are making a bad from that uh, by mutual understanding they are doing everything they are actually want to prove that i am a very big vaishnav because i am preaching because they are so clever so clever so smart they are sitting like a jackal oh he is vaishnav how why he will speak but rup goswami pad is speaking that only a vaishnav will speak only the vaishnav has the right that uh, he can rectify the whole world but you want to prove that rup goswami pad is uh, at fault he is uh, he speaking lie but uh, 
दिस इज एक्चुअली कॉल्ड म्यूचुअल एडजस्टमेंट बिकॉज ऑफ दैट दे वॉन्ट and they will be just looting america russia and everything they will loot all the markets of there and uh, they will come back but they should at least give it something to them but they don't have anything in them uh, so what they can do give to the world but rupa goswami pad is speaking in his first shlok yeah, it will take around about 2 days to uh, uh, to start this shloka uh, or the first shlok of our rupa goswami pad it is already written in the first shlok who who is actual that is actual sadhu who has who has all his mind material senses sense control and material mind all is controlled by bhakti today we will just be uh, uh, doing up till here and uh, for give me i will uh, start it the first look i just have to start with the background of the updesh amrit and after that uh, we can uh, get into the actual uh, uh, shri updesh amrit because we have a lot of misconception is mind because uh, the whole uh, garbage is there of material world inside our heart because what we it is very important to uh, give the indication that what mahaprabhu has given the instruction to rup goswami pad and what rup goswami rup goswami pad wants to speak about the present situation pavartito aham vara karu upayopi tasho hare he padakamalam bande chaitanya devasya vanchakalpadurvasi ke basind bhavcha patitanan pavan bhav vishnu bhyo namo